we need Reggie in the back, even though he's. Hey, this is what you got to spell, but we can't be mugging in her. Okay. All right, ready? Here we go. Ready to try? Guys, fellas, here we three. go. Three. We jump three, two, one, jump. Oh, I didn't jump. <laughs> Hi, I'm Sarah Miller. I'm a photographer for the Tyler Morning Telegraph. Today we're out at Earl Campbell Field at Trinity Mother Francis Rose Stadium in Tyler. That's the home of John Tyler High School and Robert E. Lee football. We're working on our 2013 East Texas football preview section, and here's a little behind the scenes look at this photo shoot. So I'll just take a couple different pictures, so just keep struggling. You can do if one of you wants to like fall off or whatever, that's fine. I don't one of you guys want to win. Ain't nobody <laughs> falling off. Fellas, if one, if, if one team wants to win too, that's fine. Yeah, if you, you guys, can like grab it. <laughs> if one team wants to actually get it. <laughs> okay. You guys ready? One, two, three. Here we go. Today's shoot is a red versus blue tug of war concept with John Tyler and Robert E. Lee guys fighting over one of the city's most iconic symbols, roses. It doesn't hurt that both teams call Rose Stadium their home field either. In the past, the rivalry between Tyler's two major high schools has truly been a tug of war, but is it still the same today? You'll have to read Chris Perry's story to find out. Pick up your own copy of the 2013 East Texas Football Preview inside Thursday's Tyler Morning Telegraph.